seems like it was just almost yesterday. It just, time flies by, but four years and here we are, so. One of my favorite things about this facility from an event and activity standpoint is just having the ability to have so many different activities taking place at one time. Coming in on a Thursday night, we might have coffee house concerts in our community rooms and we have adaptive recreation basketball going on in our gyms and dance classes upstairs and fitness classes and people just using the, the building for using the track and, and that to me is what's really most exciting about this facility is being able to bring so many people together and so I can't say there's one specific event that I love but I love seeing how the synergy of multiple events and programs happening at one time can still take place. I think the, the most exciting program that's taken place here is the mom to mom sale because the building is packed with people selling stuff and people buying stuff and it's a lot of people that would not normally come into the building so it's a lot of new, new eyes on it. So I, we would actually, speaking for both of us, we'd come in here. So we were on the basketball team so for Stevenson. So uh, it, the practice starts at four, so we'd come here in the meeting time, either play there, play basketball, warm up. And sometimes we just do our homework and chill up there. There's like so many things to do around here. And we, saw, we actually, I actually played pickleball one time with my friend. Just the, the community here, just everybody. It's like we have the same regulars every day that we enjoy talking to and seeing. And it, it's just, uh, yeah, it's a good community to be around. It's amazing to think where we've come in the last four years from when we opened in, in 2020. But we know that the next four years have so much more in store for the Parks and Recreation Department and the residents of Sterling Heights. So I invite you to leap on in and see what we're all about.